my wife and I just got back from a trip to Boston. This wasn't a photography trip, it was a family trip. We had a wedding and a lot of other stuff going on, so I didn't get to do much snapping, but I did some. The trip started with Tess and I making the 14 hour drive up, and we got there just in time to celebrate Ted's birthday. Happy birthday. So this is the gear I brought on this trip, my X-T4 with the 35 f2 and the 18-135 to zoom lens, which I did not use at all. And then I brought this Rolecord 120 film camera with some Ilford HP5 and a bunch of Cinestill. This is all I shot though. The next day was my 37th birthday, I'm old now, and I celebrated with shooting some film. Now the question is, do I move the Coke bottle, or do I leave the Coke bottle? I'm gonna leave it. Uh, I have F10, 1 250th of a second. I'm gonna frame up that bench right in between these two trees. like a few of these. You really can't beat Ilford HP5, although I have no idea what the hell happened with these. That night we had the rehearsal dinner for the wedding in Salem. I didn't see any witches, but I did manage to get some shots with my phone that I really like. Next morning, I had all to myself. I loaded up the Rolly with Cinestill 50D, grabbed my Fuji, and walked around the neighborhood. This is another keeper I got with my phone. I just, it's hard to beat the phone sometimes. That night, it was time for the wedding in New Hot, which is just outside the city. The venue was this beautiful seaside place called uh, this. When I wasn't taking advantage of the free booze, I managed to sneak off and found this little park with a view of the city skyline in the distance. So this view of the city right here is incredible. And there are planes touching down like every few minutes or so. I try to catch a plane. I really wish I had my zoom lens with me because it would have been so cool to get those planes flying in a lot closer. I think that might have been something. The wedding was a ton of fun. The next day was our last day up in Boston. My wife, sister-in-law, and I went downtown where they were going to do some shopping and I was going to do some snapping. <laughs> Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
For some reason, I found it really hard to get into like a street photography groove while I was there. I didn't have any confidence. I kept missing focus. I just couldn't get in the zone. I'm not in love with any of these really, but I do like this one. This is cool. Let me get in that. His buddy came up next, right behind him, and offered this super cheesy grin. But what do you know? I missed focus. Next, I met up with my longtime friends Ryan and Sam, who are both Boston residents, so they knew all the places to go, which was awesome. We mostly just walked along the waterfront and drank. into Regina's Pizza, probably the biggest dive I've ever been to. Highly recommended. chill at Sam's apartment rooftop, which had amazing views. That's city life, man. I, I could totally get into it. We walked around some more and I found one of these steam ground thingies. They definitely don't have these in Knoxville. I kept waiting around to get the perfect shot, but I will really have a chance to photograph these when I go to New York soon. So I guess my camera had died at some point while I was filming that last intro, so here is a new one. I love Boston. I mean, Tess and I have both said that if we didn't live here and have our lives and work and family and all that, here in Knoxville we would totally live there. Maybe one day. It's a dream for photography, I love the Red Sox, and I get a good vibe from Boston. I don't know, we'll see. So I hope you guys enjoyed that short video. If you want to support the channel, like, subscribe, do all that. Check out my print shop, use the affiliate links, all that stuff. I appreciate you guys as always. I'll see you in the next one. Happy birthday to you. Oh, look at that. Is that Gordon? Thank you, Elias, because you're the passion for caramel. What's with the orange? What's the orange? <laughs> yeah. Oh, look at the plate. Oh, Mike, did yes. you see the plate? No. Oh, cool. <laughs> that is a beautiful. Look, can you see this?
Somebody's a calligrapher back here. What did here. they say? 